everyone, I've got some new dolls to share with you today. These are Cave Club dolls. Um, I ordered them from Amazon. I was rather hoping that the BMR or the new LOLs would be out, but they're not out yet here. So I, I when these first, when I first saw these, that um, I saw some pictures of them at Toy Fair, and I thought, oh, they look really interesting. One of the things that attracted me to them is that they're articulated and really colourful. From the pictures I've seen, they remind me a little bit of Hair Dorables, but I couldn't get any sense of what size they are. I've seen a few of them on Instagram and things like that, but I still, I still don't know how big they are, so we're about to find out together. Yeah, I've got two of them, so one of them um, was 19 99 because it's like a playset and comes with a baby and the other one a single doll was 14 99 so I didn't think that was a bad price and they're not blind you know like hair adorables are in a blind box these are these are oh yay oh amazing right really pleased they're bigger than I thought they were going to be. Taller than uh, taller than I thought they were going to be. I was a bit worried they were going to be the same height as a hair adorable, but they're not. Here's the two I've got. So I've got Cave Club Rural Eye. Oh, look at her hair. It's amazing. So I've got Cave Club Rural Eye, and she comes with feral. <laughs> look at this. Her little, uh, it looks like a little, some kind of wild cat cub called Feral. I will open them up in a minute and she's got a bag there, a hair comb. Look at the picture on the back, that's really good as well, isn't it? And it tells you a bit about Rural Eye on there. Meet Cave Club, a truly unruly group of prehistoric first friends. So we will open them up. The second one I got is Furnessa and furrer look at this one she's so cute look at her face i will take them out and we'll have a proper look at them so this one was 19.99 and this one was 14.99 so let's open this one up and have a look oh, i'm really pleased with with the size of them i was a bit worried they were going to be the same size as the hair adorables but they're not so from the top of her head to her feet she's eight inches which is a bit little bit shorter than a brat's but she's fully articulated. You can see her head's quite nice and poseable. Very small neck hole for anyone wanting to do head swaps with her. She's got elbow articulation, wrist articulation, cute little hands. She's got hip, um, not in and out, but forward and back. And she's got the knee to the L, like I say. Uh, no ankle articulation, but her knee will turn and will bend to the L. She's got like these, what are supposed to look like tied on fur, I think, things around her ankles. She's got long purple, love that hair, long purple hair. She's got like a bone, I think it's meant to be a bone decoration in the top of her hair. And then she's got this crimped like ponytail at the top. I love her so much. She's got this little fur shrug on. You can see it goes round and then round the back there. And then she's got this flame coloured and black dress with a little like boob tube there. And she's got this little belt with some more bone decorations on it. So that's her. She's so cute, isn't she? Ah! And she's got face painting. You can see the bones on there. She's got really pretty eyes. Oh, I think she's lovely. I really like her. I may have to go. I may have to go on and order the rest of them now. Ooh, love her. Yeah, she's she's really cute. I really like her. And will she stand on her own? Let's test that out. Yeah, she can stand on her own. She does have fairly big feet. You won't be able to put shoes on her. Not, you know, she wouldn't fit Barbie shoes. She's a Mattel doll. Yeah, lovely. Really pleased with her. So that's her, and she came with. Her little, looks like some kind of wild cat to me that's called Feral, I love that. <laughs> it's got a pink tuft on its head and purple stripes. Little tail at the back there. It's like a little wild cat kitten, like a saber-toothed tiger look. 
and then she's got her little bag which has like little I'm not sure what that's whether that oh yeah that looks like a headband as well look maybe you can put that on her in her head in her hair yeah look you can wear that as a headband that was attached to her bag which looks like a little cat look hmm and it, do, it does have an opening when you take that off and then there's it's also this hair comb which i assume that's probably not for her but for for uh, for you to wear let's see oh yeah beautiful that suits me i think let's try it in this side oh yeah lovely <laughs> i can be a cave club girl so that was her really pleased with her lovely and then we go on to Vanessa and Furra instead of Farrah. So it's World About Babysitting, it says. Vanessa and Furra. There we are. Look at the pictures on the back. I love that pink hair. She's so cute. Look at her. Really, I really love these dolls. I'm definitely going to buy the rest of them. I absolutely love them. To me, they're better than... I'm not a huge fan of hair adorables. I do have some of the her amazing dolls they're the taller ones but the hair adorables i don't like that they're blind bags so much i you know much prefer getting a doll that i know i'm gonna get and yeah so pleased with these cave club dolls and also these like i say are, are a bit bigger so we'll start with finessa look at her she's lovely I think she's the same, yeah, she's another 8 inch doll, the same as the, the first doll. Same articulation, she's got a different skin tone, pretty lips, she's got some face painting as well. Her hair is this two-tone pink, I think it's nylon hair, it feels like nylon. Um, it's fairly well rooted, you can see, she's got, she's got enough hair anyway. She's got a headdress on there. She's got this shoulder piece. She's got this lovely dress which looks like leopard print. Obviously different colours from leopard. But then she's got these what look like vines wrapped around her ankles. And the big feet as well. Really cute. Love her little face. Look at that face. They remind me a little bit of Monster Highs. But like a younger version of Monster Highs. Yeah, I'd say she was like 12 or 13. That's what I think anyway. Maybe I've got that wrong. But yeah, she's cute. I like her. I like these so much. I like the size of them. They're bigger than hair adorables, but not as big as Barbie. And then we have the cute little furrer. Oh, look how cute she is. She's got a little nappy on and a little top under there and a bib. Uh, little top velcros in the back look at that fabulous hair it's lilac with like a pink streak in the front there she it's really like fluffy and <laughs> cute she comes with a little dummy that looks like a little it looks like a little woolly mammoth let's pop it in her mouth look at that <laughs> Yeah, it looks like a, a woolly mammoth with the tusks and the trunk there. She also comes with a little tiny bottle, a little green bottle. Then she's got this little ride-on pink dinosaur. It's got blue spots on it. She's got her dinner, which she's been gnawing on, which is a carrot. Um, there's a little book which shows pictures of dinosaurs in it. And then she's got her little cot or playpen, which has that little dinosaur hanging over the side with her mobile on it. It's got blue and orange flying pterodactyls by the look of it on it, or birds. Yeah, and there she is. She stands in there. So cute! Absolutely love them. I really like them. You can buy Vanessa on her own. You don't have to buy her in the playset with Farrah, but but I thought for the extra five pounds it was worth getting the extra the extra doll the small doll I love her mm, I love that set really cute so 
those were my cave club girls i hope you enjoyed that thank you for watching bye for now